So, over there we have an Ottoman building this time, which is uh, from 16th century, it's 500 years old. It was the palace of Ibrahim Pasha. Ibrahim Pasha was a Grand Vizier, Grand Vizier of a great Sultan, called Sultan Suleiman the Magnificent. In Ottoman system, Sultan means first man. He had the absolute power, like king or emperor. And Grand Vizier means second man, the highest bureaucrat. Uh, by the way, you'll hear the name of Sultan Suleiman several times during this tour because Sultan Suleiman is really important for Istanbul and for 16th century world history. He was the Sultan of the Golden Age of the Ottoman Empire and in 16th century, Ottoman Empire was really huge, like Roman Empire. It was covering nearly all Eastern Europe, some parts of today's Ukraine, today's Armenia, Georgia, Middle Eastern Peninsula, all Arabic countries and Israel and all Northern African coast, from Egypt till Morocco. It was all of Ottoman Empire. So Sultan Suleiman was the ruler of that time. And Ibrahim Pasha was the Grand Vizier of, uh, of Sultan Suleiman. But he was not only a Grand Vizier, but also Sultan's best friend, because they grew up together from their childhood. And Sultan was telling all his secrets to Ibrahim Pasha. So he was the favorite guy, the favorite bureaucrat in 16th century AD. And he got married with the sister of Sultan Suleiman. So this building was a wedding present from Sultan Suleiman to Ibrahim Pasha, which was so extraordinary because he was just a Grand Vizier. But like a Sultan, he had his own palace, which was more luxurious than the Topkapı Palace. Everybody was jealous about him. But after some points, he became really very popular, even more popular than Sultan Suleiman. And Sultan didn't like it. There are lots of rumors about it, but shortly at the end, he was killed by the order of Sultan Suleiman at the top of palace during the dinner, actually. So, uh, after that event, this building became a kind of prison for political prisoners in 16th century. It was a palace, then it became a prison. Today, it's a museum, at the Museum of Turkish and Islamic Arts. If you love historical types of museums, uh, this is one of my favorites, actually, in the city. Uh, and uh, it will take only one hour for you to visit. Just keep in mind. And there's an impressive, very impressive collection of handmade Turkish carpets from 13th century, which were brought here from some old mosques of Turkey. So just keep in mind. It's a really nice museum to visit. Any questions? Okay, let's continue through German fountain over there. Please follow me. Uh, personally, I don't prefer to be recorded oh, during sorry, the tour. Oh, sorry. oh, sorry. Time to time you can record something, but yeah. during the tour or... Oh, during the tour. The 